what is a solo ad and most importantly, how can you use solo ads to drive more sales to your products and to your services? Hi guys, it's Sam Day here from daytips.com and in this video I'm speaking about solo ads and how you can leverage the use of solo ads to increase the amount of sales to your products and services online. Essentially, a solo ad is whenever you are paying to be advertised through someone else's email list. So for example, there might be someone who blogs about beauty related topics on their website and on their website they might have a sign up form where people can subscribe to their email list. So let's say that the person who blogs about beauty has managed to generate two or three thousand people on their email list so they have two or three thousand names and email addresses of people who are interested in beauty now if they were to send out an email to those two or three thousand people advertising your product or your service in return for a fee you know maybe you pay them 50 or 100 pounds to do it for you then that is essentially a solo ad now because that person has hopefully been providing those two or three thousand people with a lot of value sending them valuable emails in the form of blog articles maybe even videos then they're likely to have a really good relationship with the thousands of people that they have on their email list and as a result you're likely to get very good results if you actually advertise your products or your services by using that person and advertising to their database. Now I'm actually going to show you one method that you can use to find solo ad opportunities to help you market your products or your services. Now this is just one method and I may be doing some more methods on solo ads and how you can leverage solo ads so make sure you're subscribed to the channel so you don't miss those. But let's just say for example you have a pet product and you're trying to use solo ads to increase sales. So as you can see on my computer I'm actually on Google and I've typed in advertise on a pet blog. Now the reason why I've typed this in is because I'm trying to find someone who has a pet blog and who has followers and subscribers of people who you know are interested in pet products and who may be interested in my pet product if I was actually selling a pet product. So as I actually scroll down I can see this particular blog which says advertise with gopetfriendly.com and when I clicked on their link, if I scroll down a little bit further and go to, in a nutshell, it tells you that they have 64,000 visitors to their website, around 55,000 unique visits um, per month. They have 109,000 page views, views per month. And um, they also have 150,000 Facebook fans and 70,000 Twitter followers. And if you go down a little bit further, you can also see that they have over 2,000 email subscribers. So this is very important information. Whenever you find a blog and you want to advertise um, on that person's blog, always check how many email subscribers they have. And also, you know, see their other social entities as well. How many Facebook followers do they have? How many Twitter followers they have? That will show you a good indication of actually, you know, whether or not it's worth getting a solo ad from this particular provider. So if I was selling a pet related product and I found this particular website that had over 2000 plus subscribers to their email list, I could send them out an email or contact this particular uh, company and ask them how much it would cost for me to send out a solo ad or for me to send out an email to their 2,000 plus subscribers. Um, sometimes what they do is actually send the email out on your behalf. So one of the most effective emails I could have sent out to these 2,000 people is not just go and buy my product, but it's actually an email that gives something of value away for free. So for example, after I contact these guys and they agree to send out an email to their 2,000 plus subscribers, the email that I actually have sent out might be something like, hey, go download my free report on how to make sure that your pet is always healthy and when they click the link in the email they head over to my landing page which says you know enter your name and email address and you can get access to this free report which shows you how to make sure your animal is always healthy and that way I have those people on my database now 
and then I can market my products to that particular client group. So hopefully you can see that this technique I've just demonstrated is a great way for you not just to sell your products and services, but also for you to build your own database as well, to build up your own names and email addresses of people who are interested in your particular niche. So obviously if you're selling pet related products, you wouldn't go to a business blog. So you actually wanna narrow it down as much as you can so that you're actually emailing out to people who are specifically your target group. So hopefully after watching this video, you now have a firm understanding of what solo ads actually are and you have a method of which you can go and implement and leverage the use of solo ads to help you sell more products and build your own database at the same time. If this video did help you out, then please click the like button down below and make sure you share it with a friend. If you have any additional questions or comments, then leave them for me in the comment section and I'll answer it as soon as I can. But until next time, watch some of my other great videos, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more awesome content. Have a great day and I will see you soon.